Jennifer Jason Lee, a versatile and accomplished actress, has left an indelible mark on the landscape of American cinema. With a career spanning several decades, her body of work reflects a commitment to diverse and challenging roles. Whether it's her poignant portrayal in The Hateful Eight or her compelling performance in Single White Female, Lee's ability to inhabit characters with depth and authenticity resonates with audiences. As we contemplate the question of which work by Jennifer Jason Lee holds a special place in our hearts, it becomes a subjective journey through her filmography. From her breakout role in Fast Times at Ridgemont High to her more recent contributions, each film adds a layer to the tapestry of her artistic legacy. Delving beyond the screen, there's a curiosity about lesser known facets of Lee's life. Are there anecdotes or facts that reveal the person behind the performances? The allure lies in discovering the nuances that make her not just an actress, but a human being with a unique journey. As we open the floor to your cherished memories or personal experiences related to this classic Hollywood actor, we invite you to share your stories in the comments below. What moments from Jennifer Jason Lee's career have etched themselves into your own narrative? Your insights contribute to a collective appreciation of this remarkable artist. What work of Jennifer Jason Lee resonates with you? And what intriguing facets of her life captivate your imagination? We would love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. In the glittering realm of Hollywood, one name that has quietly woven itself into the fabric of cinematic brilliance is that of Jennifer Jason Lee. Unveiling her talent at an early age, Lee stepped into the limelight with an innate ability to immerse herself completely into the characters she portrayed, leaving an indelible mark on the silver screen. Born into a lineage of creativity, Jennifer's roots were firmly planted in the artistic soil. The daughter of esteemed actor Vic Morrow, she inherited a passion for the craft that would shape her destiny. However, Jennifer's journey was no mere inheritance of talent. It was a relentless pursuit of authenticity that became the hallmark of her career. Lee's breakthrough came with her role in the gritty crime drama Miami Blues, where her performance garnered critical acclaim. Yet, it was her ability to seamlessly transition between genres that truly set her apart. From the dark, neo-noir landscapes of Last Exit to Brooklyn to the poignant drama of single white female, she effortlessly navigated diverse roles, each one a testament to her chameleon-like prowess. It was in Quentin Tarantino's cult classic, The Hateful Eight, that Jennifer Jason Lee delivered a masterclass in acting, earning her an Academy Award nomination. Her portrayal of Daisy Domerk, a gritty and unapologetic outlaw, showcased her ability to breathe life into characters that defy conventional norms. Beyond the glitz of awards and accolades, Lee's commitment to her craft is evident in her lesser-known ventures. She has lent her voice to animated characters, adding depth and nuance even to the unseen. Her foray into writing and directing with the film The Anniversary Party further underscored her multifaceted talent, proving that her creative brilliance extended far beyond the spotlight. Despite the intricacies of her characters, there is an underlying vulnerability in Lee's performances that resonates with audiences. Her ability to infuse humanity into the most complex roles reflects a profound understanding of the human condition, making her a true artist in every sense. In the ever-evolving landscape of cinema, Jennifer Jason Lee remains an enigmatic force, weaving narratives that transcend time and genre. Her journey is a testament to the transformative power of storytelling, where each role is a brushstroke on the canvas of her illustrious career. As we continue to unravel the layers of this cinematic luminary, one thing becomes clear Jennifer Jason Lee is not just an actress, she is an architect of emotions, constructing a legacy that transcends the silver screen. And with that, we find ourselves drawn into the captivating tapestry of Jennifer Jason Lee's career, a tapestry that continues to unfold with each passing role, leaving an indelible impression on the hearts of cinephiles around the world. Consider this fact. Jennifer Jason Lee auditioned for the role of Catwoman in Batman Returns. This glimpse into her career unveils not just her diverse acting abilities, but also the intriguing paths she navigated in Hollywood. Lee's foray into the audition room for the iconic role of Catwoman showcases her willingness to embrace varied characters. Although she didn't land the part, this attempt sheds light on her choices and aspirations within the film industry. Beyond the audition, Lee's personal life also interweaves with Hollywood narratives. Living with Eric Stoltz for five years during the 80s adds a layer of complexity to her story. Interestingly, Stoltz portrayed the title character in The Fly Roman 2, while Lee was considered for the role of Veronica in The Fly. 
The intersections of her personal and professional life offer a glimpse into the intricacies of her journey. The punk band Jade Church even dedicated a song, Jennifer Jason Lee, with lyrics crafted from interview quotes. This musical tribute reflects the impact and recognition she garnered, not only in the cinematic realm, but also within popular culture. From auditions to personal relationships and even musical homage, Jennifer Jason Lee's presence extends beyond the silver screen, creating a tapestry of experiences that shape her unique narrative in Hollywood. Jennifer Jason Lee's journey in Hollywood is marked by intriguing choices and moments that shaped her diverse career. One such pivotal point was her victory in securing the role of Amy Archer in The Hudsucker Proxy, triumphing over the likes of Winona Ryder and Bridget Fonda. This casting decision not only underscored Lee's acting prowess, but also positioned her as a formidable force in the industry. However, the road to success is often paved with missed opportunities. Jennifer Jason Lee found herself in consideration for the role played by Holly Hunter in The Piano. Unfortunately, due to her commitment to the film rush at the time, she was unable to meet with director Jane Campion. This near miss sheds light on the delicate balance actors must strike between projects and the potential turns their careers might have taken. Delving into Lee's commitment to her craft, it's worth noting her dedication to transforming for roles. In the TV movie, The Best Little Girl in the World, she underwent a significant physical transformation, shedding weight down to 86 pounds to authentically portray an anorexic teenager. This commitment to realism showcases her willingness to immerse herself fully into the characters she brings to life on screen. Jennifer Jason Lee's career is a mosaic of choices, victories, and near misses, each contributing to the rich tapestry of her Hollywood narrative. From outshining fellow actresses in casting decisions to navigating the challenges of conflicting schedules, Lee's journey is a testament to her resilience and commitment to the art of acting. As we continue to explore the layers of her career, it becomes evident that Jennifer Jason Lee is not merely an actress. She is a master of her craft, leaving an indelible mark on the cinematic landscape. As we bid adieu to this cinematic journey, let's take a moment to ponder the tapestry woven by the remarkable performances of a certain acclaimed actress. You know the one a talent so nuanced and captivating, she leaves an indelible mark on the very essence of storytelling. Think back to the moments when the silver screen came alive with raw emotion and unparalleled depth, courtesy of an actress who effortlessly inhabits her characters, breathing life into each role with an authenticity that resonates beyond the confines of the frame. Now, dear reader, it's your turn to step into the spotlight. What memories do you hold close? Which performances stirred your soul or made you question the very fabric of human experience? Share your reflections, for in this exchange, we unite through the shared appreciation of artistry. Perhaps it was a particular scene that etched itself into your memory, or maybe it's the cumulative impact of a career that spans genres and emotions. Your thoughts are a testament to the enduring power of cinema and the profound connection we forge with those who bring narratives to life. As we celebrate the impact of this remarkable artist on the tapestry of entertainment, we extend our deepest gratitude for your time and engagement. Your reflections add a unique layer to the collective appreciation for the art of storytelling, and for that, we thank you. In closing, let the resonance of these performances linger in your thoughts, and may the magic of cinema continue to inspire and connect us all. Until next time, take a bow, dear reader, for you are an integral part of the narrative.